transkrip yang dilaporkan dalam LE Daily Telegram tidak tidak sahih tidak tepat. And I have to uh, inform that the transcript between the aircraft and the controllers, as reported in the Daily Telegram, is not accurate. One question of the opposition. Hi, I'm Jimmy from Malaysia Kini. Uh, I have a question for Ahmad Jafri. There's a report in the Sydney Morning Herald two days ago about uh, claims that if Mars has subscribed to a, uh, an upgrade with satellite services, uh, I believe it cost $10 to buy, uh, then it would have been able to receive more data that would be useful, even if the ETAS and other systems were out. Could you comment on that and perhaps explain what the system is? Uh, I, I think that system is uh, something to do with uh, increasing the bandwidth uh, for the use of the satellite communication. Uh, we believe the current uh, system that we have, we do know that actually fulfill all our operational requirement. Right? So that's just an, an, an upgrade. Uh, you know, we just need more info, but we don't think it is something that, you know, even if we have the system, will help in our current situation. Yes, yes. Um, Department of Defense in the US, they are, they are saying that the US $4 million funding for SCR ops will come to an end at uh, the end of April. Uh, when the funding ends, uh, will you also stop uh, the SCR operations? And also, how much have you spent so far in the rest mm. of the I, I, I that's the, the best part uh, of this whole uh, operation. Nobody, not the Malaysian government, none of our partners have talked about dollars and cents. It's all about trying to find the aircraft. Is there a rough estimate? No, we didn't even, even, it didn't even cross our mind. 